How can I create a Modbus communication between a PFC and a Modbus slave? Here we've got a PFC 200, which is our Modbus master, and we want to connect to a Modbus slave. So we can go to the product catalog and choose from the folder other communication parties, Modbus TCP, the generic Modbus slave. This can now reproduce the real Modbus slave we have. So in the settings, we set it to the IP address our slave has. In my case, this is the 1.17. And if we do a double click on the Modbus slave, we can recreate the data points which this Modbus slave has. Mostly you will get those from the manual of the Modbus slave. So here, my Modbus slave has two data points which I have to recreate. So I do a right click and then add. The first data point is R get from slave because we want to get this variable from the slave. This name that I type in here can be anything you want this to be named. The data type in my case is real and we want to read this. So if I do a double click on the Modbus address, we get uh, the window where we, where we can set the function code for Modbus. In this case, function code three is fine and we can set the register, which is zero for me as well, which is fine too. And writing is not available. This is correct. So I hit okay. And then for the second data point, we have a word, so W, and then we want to set it. So set in slave. So the data type is already correct. And then we can do a double click again. This time we don't want to read. So we set this to not available. And then function code writing is function code six, which is fine. But the register, I have to change to the register, which I get from the manual of my slave, which is 32,000. I hit okay. And now my slave is already configured in the way I've got the real slave on my desk. Now if I go back to the network view, we can make the connection from the master to the slave and then open up the Modbus configurator. Here it is very simple because we can just take our two data points we just created and publish those. So we have them in the configurator and they are already in read and write only according to the variables and the function codes. Now if I go to the PSC PRG, we'll see that it creates the Modbus view. And so I can type in Modbus, then name of the slave and name of the variable. I will just call those variables for now so we can see what is happening. Again, name of the slave and then name of the variable and then connect to my controller. Now I can start the application and we can see that we are already reading the value from the slave. And if we want to write the value, the second variable, I can just put in a value for the, my variable here and then using debug and write, we can write this to the slave. 